In Excel, a cell reference is simply the column and row that identifies a particular cell. For example, the cell in the first column of the first row is referred to as A1. In your formulas, you can make either relative references or absolute references to cells. The difference is that when a cell with a formula in it is copied, absolute references will be unchanged, but relative references will be adjusted relative to the new location. A dollar sign in front of a reference makes it absolute. You can type the dollar sign yourself, or you can use the F4 key to switch a reference between relative and absolute. Here is a good example of how this can save you time. Here we have a list of sales by department. We want to see what percentage of total sales comes from each department. You could go to the empty cell at C2 and enter equals B2 divided by B10, which would be department 1 monthly sales divided by a total monthly sales. But if you copy that formula down, on the next line it would become B3 divided by B11. The line after that would be B4 divided by B12, and so on. We need each line to divide by the total in B10. To fix the problem, change the first formula to B2 divided by B dollar sign 10. Now when it is copied down the column, the relative reference B2 will be adjusted for each row, but B dollar sign 10 will remain the same. Next, highlight cells B2 through B10. Copy them and paste them into column E next to the year-to-date amounts. Now the references to column B, monthly sales, will automatically be changed to D, year-to-date sales.